Hiya, uh, I'm Rowan and I'm an undergrad coming to the end of my second year at Clare studying history and politics uh, and I'll just talk quickly about what I like about being a student at Clare uh, and what I like about my subject. So in terms of what I like about Clare, I think it's genuinely a really welcoming community. Cambridge as a whole is a welcoming place for students I'd say but Clare has a reputation as a really friendly, fun college and I think that's deserved. We've got a fantastic bar, one of the very best college bars in Cambridge, I'd say. Uh, I like the library. Uh, the librarians are really nice, helpful people. Uh, it's really well the case as well. None of the accommodation is too far out of town. But also, it's not slap bang in the middle. So it doesn't get really busy with tourists or noisy because of the market. But you're, you're 10, 15 minutes away from basically everything, which is really, really helpful. Uh, I really like the college system in Cambridge as well. I think it's really good for making friends. There's about 150 or so people in every year group, which is small enough that you can actually get to know loads and loads of people, which I think you don't always get in the same way at non-collegiate unis. The extracurricular stuff is terrific as well. So right now I'm on the student union for Clare as the mental health and disabilities officer. And obviously with the pandemic, there's a lot going on at the moment in that area, but it's great fun as well. Uh, and it's great to feel like you're helping other students out. You can do stuff like optional language courses. I did a French course last year which I really enjoyed. There's plenty of college level sport available uh, and the sports societies at Clare tend to presume there's no prior experience which is great if you want to get into something new. I've played mixed netball which I never even knew was a thing before I came to uni so that's been really fun. Rowing is a big thing at Cambridge if you're keen to try that out. Loads of people really really love that. Uh, there's so many different options you can try. I've also had the chance to get involved with some charities which has genuinely been one of the highlights of my time at uni done homeless volunteering. Uh, I also got involved with an international development charity called Education Partnerships Africa and they gave me the opportunity to go and work in Kenya last summer which was a life-changing experience. Uh, and yeah there's so many different extracurricular options available depending on what you like, what you want to get involved in. It's a fantastic opportunity to try out new stuff I'd say. In terms of what I like about my degree there's, there's loads really. Uh, I really like the choice I get. So one of my papers in second year was called World History Before 1914. And my supervisor literally said to me, just pick the six topics you're most, most interested in from an incredibly long list. So I've done so much fascinating stuff that I'd never known anything about before. Stuff about history in the Caribbean, in New Zealand, uh, stuff about Islam in Southeast Asia. It's fantastic. Like, I love having these opportunities. Then aside from the standard history papers, you get to do political science papers. I really enjoy studying the politics of East Africa, which I barely knew anything about before this paper. So it's really, really specific content. Uh, I also got to do political philosophy, studied some fascinating stuff like the German Romantics, uh, Karl Marx. I also did a statistics paper this year. So the fact that you can do so many different things in one degree is terrific, and I really love it. The, um, the standard of teaching you get is really fantastic as well. Like in my first year, I had a supervisor who's a regular contributor to the New Statesman, which is amazing. I feel so lucky to have been taught by someone who's that distinguished in their field. It is definitely a challenge uh, in some senses being at Clare because you're doing academic work at an intensity that you probably haven't experienced before and that can definitely be stressful at times. Um, but it's also quite exhilarating in a way. Like you'd be studying your, your chosen subject under supervision from some of the very best in the world so it's a fantastic opportunity to learn, learn your chosen subject. Cambridge's teaching model of supervisions is really good as well, I think. Uh, like often they're one-on-one -on -one or like, you know, often they'll just have a couple of other super partners. So it's really sort of personalised teaching so you can get like feedback specifically to do with you rather than what lots of other unis have, which is much bigger groups. Um, and although it is stressful, there's plenty of support services available in Cambridge. They recognise that it can be really difficult. So don't think that you'd be sort of left isolated. That's definitely not how it would be. Um, yeah, anyway, I'd definitely encourage you to apply if you're interested. It's been one of the best decisions I've ever made for sure. I absolutely love it at Cambridge. Uh, I know that the overwhelming majority of students at Clare really like it as well. It's an incredible opportunity to make friends, have pretty much unparalleled teaching, uh, try out so many new things. So yeah, um, I hope that this has given a bit of an insight about life at Clare.